All right, I need to think of some kind of intro. Hello, PewDiePie here, bro feast. Fuck, I can't do it. I can't do it. Oh, God, that's so cringe. So, for those of you who don't keep up with my Twitter or don't actually know, my car got stolen. Yeah, it really sucks, and there's a story behind that, and that is what I'm going to tell you right now. So, I live in Las Vegas. I'm not going to tell you exactly where I live because some of you fucks have sent me some ridiculous messages already, so God knows what you'd do to me if you actually met me in real life. But, uh, I live in Las Vegas. And this actually happened a while ago. This happened over Thanksgiving. So I left to come back to California to visit family for Thanksgiving and just general holiday stuff. And I told my roommate to, oh God, I told him to look after my car. (laughs) I told them to look after my car. I'm laughing because I'm remembering this. I told them to look after my car when I left. And uh, I went and visited my family for the holidays, uh, Thanksgiving, everything was going fine, everything was going great, it was all good, and then all of a sudden I, you know, decided to talk to my roommate just to catch up, you know, wish him a happy Thanksgiving and everything like that, so I start talking to my roommate, and I bring up my car, I'm like, hey man, you know, how's Thanksgiving going, he's like, it's good, you know, all that shit, I'm like, hey man, how's my car, is everything there, is it still there, he's like, uh, let me actually go check. I'm like, oh, okay. So he leaves. He just doesn't come back until like 10 minutes later. And he comes back. He's like, dude, your car's not there. I'm like, <laughs> that's that's funny, man. That's that's funny. Uh, but it's good, right? Nobody like bumped into it or scratched it or anything like that. He's like, no, it's, it's actually not there. Your car's gone. I'm like, all right, stop joking, man. It's like holidays, Thanksgiving shit. I don't want to be messing around. He's like, no, like really, your car's actually not there. I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? My car's not there? And he's like, yeah, I took a picture of where you parked it. It's gone. Your car is fucking gone. So I'm freaking out right now because my fucking car is gone. And I don't even know how long the car's been gone for. Because he hasn't apparently been checking on it for a while. Uh, I start freaking out. And, of course, I immediately file a police report because who the fuck knows what's happening to the car right now. And, uh, yeah, so my car is just gone, right? Time goes by, nothing happens, uh, it's not checked into any places that are towed. There's, like, a registry in Nevada where you can check if your car was towed. Uh, it, it, it wasn't. So the car is fucking stolen. It's gone. It's rip. And the insurance, uh, doesn't cover it, so I'm fucked. Fortunately, it wasn't a super expensive car. But it's gone, and I am totally screwed. That's not where the story ends, though, right? That's definitely not where the story ends. Things only get more interesting, because a couple of weeks later, not days, a couple of weeks later, the police fucking show up at my place. Yeah, that's right, the police show up, and they come and tell me that they found my car. They also told me that my car was used in criminal activities, and they wanted to ask me a couple of questions, right? So, fortunately, I filed the police report that my car was stolen, because if not, I might not be uh, making this video today. I might be in prison getting, you know, butt-fucked. So, yeah. But they asked me some questions and shit, and I pretty much told them that, you know, my roommate was an asshole and didn't tell me that my car was missing over the holiday break, and then it just it just disappeared. And uh, it was cool. You know, they didn't shoot me or anything. I didn't end up in prison. I didn't get tased, you know. It was all right, but yeah, they told me that uh, they found the car and it was it was scrapped. Pieces were missing. It wasn't fully scrapped, but they told me that the pieces of the car were missing and it was abandoned. So yeah, on top of that, I, I think I had to I have to I haven't done it yet, but I'm pretty sure I have to pay some kind of bill for that because you know it has to get towed from like wherever the fuck it was dumped to some junkyard now. So yeah, pretty shitty, man. Pretty shitty, guys. So lesson learned. Fuck the police. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, God. That's... No. Okay. All right. Yeah. There's no lesson learned. I just got fucked. So, yep. That's the lesson right there. My life sucks. So, if you like the video, feel free to like it. Go ahead and share it with your friends. Feel free to subscribe to the channel. Check out all my other videos. All that YouTube shit nobody gives a fuck about. But I say it at the end of every video. Because if I don't, YouTube will fire me. Yeah. That's right. They'll fire me. And if this video can get... 420 likes then i'll go ahead and send everyone a brand new car for free yeah so thanks again guys and i'll see you all soon peace